in appearance, especially on this night. <sighs> um, do apologise for not being around much lately. I've uh, just been insanely busy with one thing or another, mainly with art stuff on the internet. So, with these guys, Mr. Jason Dagner and the Dagners, I've been doing quite a lot of work with them. So. Uh, Again, this is the perfect time to show my wonderful pumpkin pipe with the design, the wonderful stamp. Still impressed by these stamps, they're really amazing. Um, I've not smoked this, as you can see it's brand new, I'm not going to touch it tonight. I'm going to be smoking a Dagnus pipe and that's going to be the little brandy. That is what's in it. Again, thanks Jason. This is a, a cherry tobacco with a bit of a difference. Use my Zippo, which I won on eBay some time back, which I've just dug out of the cabinet. Beautiful, really well made, heavy duty, because it's not just a sticker, that's a, a it's like a metal cutout on the face of the, of the lighter. she goes so it is Halloween this, is, this video is being made on Halloween uh, in my village and it's very busy outside very very busy I've had to drop all the blinds out because I'm gonna get all these kids banging my door and you think you know really that should be on my street but it's weird really I mean my house is Halloween all the time so if you think about it I shouldn't probably do Halloween on Halloween. I should be arranging some flowers, listening to some classical music, maybe. I don't know. It's a weird one. Uh, it's a bit like that guy in the UK. I remember seeing him on the news some years ago. He celebrates Christmas all year round. Well, I'm the, I'm the same, just, just Halloween. People have come in here now and say, oh, you dressed up, you've done it all up for Halloween then. No, it's like this all the time. I may have to turn her off. Um, so yes, I've been very busy with a lot of artwork with Jason Dagner and uh, his pipes. And um, well, I can't really say much because I'm sworn to secrecy uh, with a lot of it. And you will see it crop up. You will see that ubiquitous logo turn up on something soon that you'll be surprised at. Um, you'll be f very familiar with it, but you'll be surprised. But uh, I can't really say anymore. So, mm, this is really good stuff. Uh, Jay Dagner's, I think it's his current favourite. He was a big fan of Devil's Holiday. This is how we took it. Right. a cheap toy I bought from a shop uh, a few years ago now uh, just a plain white skull basically you push his head down and sweets come out I've got a little opening at the back there but I just made it look a bit more gruesome with some paint uh, the same type of paint I use on the dolls it's a three colour blood mix Okay, okay, okay. I think that's enough for her, don't you? She's going to interrupt me. Go on. Sneak a peek. It won't hurt for long. <laughs> yeah, shut up now. Thank you. Uh, yeah, it's the same three colour mix as that. So, there you go. Um, been doing these as well. The dolls, the zombie dolls. This, this is the latest one with a, a severed foot that comes with the actual doll on Halloween. Two pipe Halloween reveal. Yeah, because 
I am going to do a separate video of this one because it deserves it. Um, well, they both do really, but uh, I was initially going to just show you the wonderful pumpkin from the Dagners, but I thought, well, in fairness, this is linked to Halloween as well, so I've got to really do this. But this is quite unique uh, because what it is, ooh, I wanted a pipe that looked like that, that skull, which I drew a long time ago for the Dagners. As you know, it became a quite a well-known tattoo. A few people have got a tattoo on the leg. Uh, but this guy, I've already got a pipe from him. I think you know I'm talking about already. And he's one of, one of the most accurate skull carvers. Well, he is the accurate skull carver in Bry. I don't know anybody else who comes anywhere near him, really. Um, as we know, we've got Yannick, who does the mission. But this is Brian. And uh, I sent him a little message on Facebook. I'll tell you what, he don't mess about. With like a few days, it was done. He sent me a picture. There you go. I thought, well, that was fast. I draw quick. This guy carves, obviously, very quick. And... Uh, here it is. Nose warmer. And the light's not very good at the moment because it's Halloween y done. But uh, there you go. I'm going to use Jason's bag to backdrop it. Basically, he's done that in a pipe and it's wonderful it's got a red stem red, red swirl acrylic stem Dagner-esque brilliant superb and of course I'm talking about I'm going to pronounce this correctly now because I've been researching his name it's O-G-U-Z and hyphen above the G so it's not pronounced so, as far as I know, and I've listened to many translations, it is pronounced Uz, Uz Simsek, um, from Nuremberg. And, dude, if I'm pronouncing that wrong, please tell me, but I'm pretty sure that's the way it is. Uh, as I said, I've got the Angry Skull that I bought a while ago, and I've been after this for a while. I've been after this, I can ask him, can he do one without the lower jaw? He does do these skulls. But he does the Harley Davidson logo at the front, which is also great if you want a Harley one. I didn't want that, of course, I wanted just this, and it, he's basically done it. And I'm over the moon with it. Over the moon, that's so nice. Uh, I, I'm, I've caught up with, I've been watching videos, a lot of videos, um, all the, uh, the pipe shows, One Man Smoke, that kind of thing, um, obviously the Dagners, and a thank you to my. Again, more subscribers who I don't even know half of them who they are, but I'm going to check them out. And I will get around to it, and I do read so back. Uh, it's just time at the minute. Um, it's either all or nothing here. Um, I've got two big, major zombie project pictures to do. One of them is almost done, and I'm going to do it completely after I've edited this video. And I actually take I took time off it to do this video tonight, and it's for my good friend down under, Glenn Thompson, pipe nutter. So I shall catch you very soon, and uh, I hope Halloween was good for me. It continues.